In this case, hopefully you're getting good at identifying the chain rule. Our inner function, u, would be 2 plus 3 f of x. And our outer function would be the square root of u, or u to the 1 half. Our u prime is then the derivative of 2 is 0. And this is just a coefficient. So I'm going to have 3 times whatever the derivative of f is, f prime of x. My v prime, 1 half u to the negative 1 half, or 1 over 2 square root of u. And I'll multiply these two together, as is our chain rule. So h prime is 3f prime of x times 1 over 2 square root of u, and u is 2 plus 3f of x. Now every x gets that number 1, because we wanted h prime at 1. So I want 3 times f prime at 1, well that's 4, times 1 over 2 times the square root of 2 plus 3 times f of 1 was 7. So now we're looking at, I'm going to divide 2 into 4 twice and get 6 over the square root of 21 so this is 21 plus 2 is 23 so 6 over the square root of 23 